Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Designs. I am back with my Advent tree. I bought three or four of these, I can't remember. Anyways, I just haven't even gotten a chance to get to these yet, but I get to do it today because we're meeting our son and daughter-in-law. I just finished their 25 Days of Christmas album. My hands are covered in paint and glue and sticky and all that, so please excuse my hands. And I'm freezing and they're all drawn like, you know, like... Oh, wait, I've got lotion in here. I didn't think I had any lotion. Anyways, but so, okay, back to this. This is an Advent little project I picked up at the Target Dollar Spot. It is so stinking cute. Um, and what it's, it was very, very affordable, first off. And it was, I think, $3? Maybe 5 No, it was 3 stinking dollars. So what you do is on every ornament, you write a message. And then you put the little sticker over it. And then they have to scratch the sticker off to see the message. And you could use this year after year after year after year because they sell these scratch off stickers every year. So, and, and literally what I may do is find these in that size and then just redo them every year for the kids and just get a punch that size and punch them out. But I have two options here, three I think. Okay, so for these I can do my names of Jesus, which is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to put the scripture and they can look it up. And then, because, um, and then I'm going to do my, or I could do the Advent of Kindness. Um, this is from a fellow YouTuber, Christopher, Christopher Allen, and it's really about giving back and being kind to people in your community, which I love doing anyway. And then, or for my crafty friends, I could do the scripture reading plan of drawing. So, for each day you get a scripture and what to draw. So it is super fun, but for my children, yeah, they're not going to, my daughter-in-law would probably enjoy that, but, and I may just make a copy and give that to her, but I did, I am going to do this, and I'm only going to do 25 days, so I think this is fun, I'm going to get started, I'm going to show you the first couple, and then I will put a picture on my Instagram and show you how it turns out, because it's just so stinking cute. Um, I am going to save this package, because it is nice and big to send it home with them. So, alrighty, I have a permanent marker. My youngest went and dug one out for me out of the kitchen drawer. <laughs> I'm going to set my stickers to the side, and I still haven't even finished eating my brunch yet, guys. Oh my goodness, it's been such a busy day, but that's okay. It's all good. It's all good. So, I'm just going to intermittently um, write these on here, and... Um, I don't, I, do, I think I'm just going to put the scripture, is what I really think I'm going to do. So, I'm just going to Revelations 5, 5, and these are the names of Jesus. So, I'm going to do, um, Revelations 1, 8. So, this is that moment in life where you have to take a minute and try to write neatly. I know. Anyways. <laughs> We're talking about me, but um, this is your opportunity for all of you that have beautiful handwriting, which I do not. Um, two forms of, of arthritis later, it's just not being nice to me. So, and and there's no real reason, you know, any, any particular order I'm going to put this down. I'm just going down through here. I'm on day four, and it's John 4, 10, and I just think this is such a great idea. Um, I love, we have got a little net in here. Okay, we have actually warm weather today, and my husband on those days opens up the door all the time. So, um, and I'm just like, close the door. Because we live in the country, and there's just critters. There's no way to get around it. It doesn't matter how much we spray, or, or I, I really don't like spraying, so I really put out more of the... Um, um, like essential oils and stuff, but anytime we have a change like this, this is the result. So, okay. So, as you can see, it's nothing difficult. It's just being semi careful that you don't make a mistake. It's also finding what you want to put down on each of these. You must make your decision before. And when I saw them, I had already planned to do scripture. I never dreamt that I would get the names of Jesus 
um, in an email, and I just love it. And this is from Araba Joy, who I love her and her ministry. I just did an online conference yesterday, a uh, women's conference with her and some amazing Christian women. And you know what? I left encouraged, and I missed bits and pieces of it because I had to work, but I, I had it on. Um, I started late, but then from then on out, I had it on. And um, there's going to be, there. she recorded it, so I'll be able to go back and listen to it again. So, she's such a smart gal. So, if you do not know, Araba, A-R-A-B-A-H-J-O-Y dot com, Araba Joy. Um, I know some of the ladies call her AJ. <laughs> um, she really has a lovely, lovely ministry. So, she and her husband were missionaries, from what I understand, and they just have a passion for Jesus, so... That's always the best. So Isaiah, I think the abbreviation is I-S-A, but if it isn't, we're going to make it today. Um, that'd be the abbreviation. Um, we're getting ready to restudy Isaiah again in our Bible study, and I'm super excited. Um, when we did it before, we were still raising and schooling kids, and um, it's so good to go back and restudy you know, Bible studies we've done before because I got to tell you, God's Word is alive and well. And we know that Jesus is referred to as the Word. And when we reread it and reapply it, um, it, it can mean something one year and mean something completely different the next year. And that is the blessing. And, um, you know, it is a living Word, no doubt. But, um, yeah. Okay, I'm almost getting there. If you are still with me, you are really a sweet trooper. Um, I just finished up my 25 Days of Christmas gift for this set of kiddos. Um, so it is a four-part series. I encourage you to hang through to the end on every single one. And in the end of the fourth one, there's something special. So I'm going to try to get this one up immediately. So it will encourage you to go take a look at that. And the only thing I forgot to share that I did not put in when I finished the project is I have um, the scripture. And for them, I'm going to email them the scripture. And, um, and you know, I'm, I won't worry about that this year. They can add it in. They can write it in. They can do whatever they want. And I think, if I remember right, my daughter-in-law has beautiful handwriting. She is quite an artist, and um, so I'm hoping she will be able to fill hers in for them. So, anyways, um, okay, John, where am I? I'm right here, John 8, 58. We are getting closer and closer, and as I hold this, I hope you're looking at the names of Jesus each day in this. And this I use for my scripture writing in my little notebook. So um, I love this. It is such a blessing. I love being on this this uh, particular um, email group. And if you're not, I encourage you to go over to her website and get signed up. There is that same stinking nap. I don't know if I got him now, but we'll hopefully he's you don't know he's still flying around so, you know what it is i have pizza over here i've been trying to eat pizza for like two hours and i haven't finished eating so i just wanted to make these videos with you guys and get these projects done and share them with y'all so okay we're at isaiah we're getting almost there 53 11 isaiah 53 so good okay and then last but not least mark 10.33. We are almost done, guys. If you leave me long enough, I can chat it up, can't I? And then for Christmas Day, King of Kings, which is Revelations, and it is 17.14. When you're doing a project like this, may I encourage you in one thing? Read twice, write once. Because, <laughs> yes, I am that person who can make a mess out of it. So, all right, that's it. We've done that part of it. Now, let me find my little sticker sheet. There we go. And I'm going to start where I started because I figured they are good and dry. So I'm just going to cover up each ornament. 
And yeah. So, how easy peasy lemon squeezy is this? Yes, you know, you heard it here. This works. You gotta be able to lay. Oh no, be careful, don't scratch it. I already scratched it. Okay, these are very scratchable. I didn't even realize that my thumbnail caught it. So, okay, learn from me. Don't make a mess. Because <laughs> if anybody can, you know it's me. Okay, so I am just going to literally just lay these down and not mess too much with them. Um, so, let me see here. This really is such a cute project. And for $3, guys, $3 and a pen, you are done. How sweet is that? And the email list was free for me. And, um, yeah. So, you know, guys, it is that. It is this simple of a project. It just takes, like, 10 minutes tops. I know. And then I'm going to go eat my pizza. <laughs> Three hours later, I'll be eating. I'll have finished lunch just in time to take our daughter-in-law and son to dinner. <laughs> so, anyways, my son just called and he was like, "Hey, could we just come and order pizza and hang out at your place?" And I said, "Well, no, because the reason I want to take you out is our place is covered." <laughs> and he was like, "Oh, okay," because <laughs> it's. He was like, "Well, you're just really tired. We just want to hang out." And I said, "I know. Me too." <laughs> So we offered to take them to the bigger city nearby and maybe, you know, go eat at our, one of our favorite hangouts, which is Taco Cabana, and then maybe go see a movie. But he was like, no, and I said, okay, because it's a little bit further down the road. But um, anyways, yeah, no. So I told him, I said, I'm so sorry. I have all my Christmas boxes out. You cannot. It's... This is, I thought I'd have it done by now, but I have been running all week. And he was like, okay, no problem, you know. So, and honestly, if they come over here, I'm going to put them to work. <laughs> going to have them lift and tote for me. <laughs> he knows where this is going. So, anyways, he is taller than all of us. Much taller. And so, God love him when he comes over. It's like, could you hang that way, way up there? Could you change that light way, way up there? Could you get down for me way up there? <laughs> He's like, sure, no problem. <laughs> He's so sweet about it. Oh, goodness. Okay, I'm almost done, my friends. Look how easy this was. Seriously. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait, the last little one. Got to be careful. It tore in a weird way, but that's okay. We can fix it. It's a sticker. So I'm going to put my star on top, and I'm done. Don't you love this? How stinking cute. I mean, seriously, friends, voila. That's it. We're done. I know. This ended up being just charming. Sorry, I hope I wasn't out of frame the whole time. Um, I, I just love this. I think this is a fun gift. $3, a little bit of time, and you're done. So I'm going to take back this little bitty... The Ziploc bag that it came in, or bag, and I'm going to probably color out. Nope, just going to peel off the price. And that is going to be wrapped. Um, if you're really good, you could wrap it in wrapping paper, but we are country people, and some things we recognize, we put a lot of time and energy in decorating, and sometimes we just, just get very utilitarian. <laughs> Not gonna lie, because see, the whole reason is it gives them the instructions on what to do. So, I love that. I think that is so much fun. Yay! Praise God, I finished. Oh, praise the Lord. All right, friends, I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. Thank you so much for stopping by. What are you making for your family this year? How are you blessing them? Just asking. And you know what? Trader Joe blessed my family with baked goods this year. So, I'm not a person who doesn't cut the cut the corners but I put them in beautiful tins and it looks beautiful for my family and that I you know I told my husband I said you know hey I open packages and threw away trash there you go and cut them up there you go so what can you do for your family that won't break the bank that you can bless somebody else because that's what this channel is about this channel is about encouraging others 
If you are not subscribed, may I encourage you to ask this question, why am I not subscribed? There's going to be drawings, there's going to be fun things this turn of the year, and we would love to have you. So subscribe if you can, hit that notification bell, like this video if you liked it, um, share this video if it would encourage anybody else, and leave a comment below if you have any questions or just want to say hi. All right, friends, I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. Thank you so much for stopping by. Um, I'm hoping you're feeling a little festive. It's, it's after a lot of crafting today. I'll kind of get this cleared out again, but um, definitely it feels like Christmas. All right, my friends, um, I'll be talking to you soon. Love you. Bye-bye.